All the horses untethered? Hi guys and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Let's go and try to rob a train, I guess. Can't you go any faster? There's a spot that's remote, but should still give them enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently, it picks up a new team of guards in the state line, so it shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. <laughs> oh, you're a funny fella, John Marston. From what folks say, eh? you had your feet up the whole time, playing sick and fondling that new scar, like you're gonna buy a breakfast in the morning. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. They're left here, towards roads. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. Plus, I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah, takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now, in the gunner sea. <laughs> Back in business, boys. <laughs> you know, my dad always used to say... Not the dad, no, please. Not this <laughs> again. Fine. Damn you three. Sulky, angry... Scarface, a right barrel of laughs. So, we blocked the tracks with the wagon, then jumped it. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John, secure the passenger car fast, take charitable donations, and make sure everyone behaves. Little Mr. McGuire. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here. Yeah. Come on, Morgan. Pick up the pace here. Okay. Who's gonna mess it up? Mr. Marsh. Mr. Smith. Mr. McGuire. Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I'll do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. What the hell? Here she comes. Not a very good idea. <laughs> Is he using the Lafarman rifle? Damn. What's going on here? What's going on? Nothing good. Let me choose another weapon. I don't want to use the Farman rifle. What the hell? Okay. I ain't got it. Wanna have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? Tell Moon to survive. Focus on the uncoupled of passengers when they were dying over. Tell him, Mr. M. Why do this? Don't help me. Come on. In the bag, everything you got. Keep it coming, don't be shy. People like you make me sick. Please do see me think we're playing a game. This is unnecessary. Please. I want a count of three. One. Two, three, Mr. M. Come on, Damn it. 
Okay. Come on, dude, give us our, your money. You got. Money, valuables. We ain't leaving till this bag's full. You won't get a damn cent from me. Let me hand you over to my friend then. Don't make me hurt. Son of a bitch. Come on, cuff it up, people. Don't be <laughs> Everything you got. Let's go. Go, go, go. I can handle this from here. You should check on Sean. Okay. Okay. None of you folks move a muscle. You hear me? Pay me what you got, mister, and you won't get hurt. Okay. What is it? You alright? Fill the baggage car. For Christ's sake, you ain't even taking a look yet? Give me your money. How do I get his money? What the hell? Why can't I aim weapon? I can't rob him. Why not? Why is there a yellow point back there? We can now manually tag enemies when aiming at the dead eye. Uh, in the dead eye. Okay, couldn't I before? Okay. This time I'll look and you provide the cover. Try me best, brother, but I'm seeing double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. Okay, so what's going on? Arthur, we've got a problem. There's two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Austin Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither you get killed. Goddamn liberties. Eh? There's a few more to turn enough. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's deal with them. Um, carbine repeater. You are wanted and have a bounty on your head. Lawmen will search for you and attack you when spotted. Why can't I change that weapon? Chance, drop your weapons and get off the train. There. Oh, there's a lot of them. Cover, man. They look like Mexicans with those hats. Okay. But wait, there was a lot of cash still here to get, no? Maybe not. Wait a second. Um, 
Did they get everything in here? Yeah, there's still a lot of cash in here. 11 bucks, at least. I'm looting, dude. You didn't loot this. Okay. Let's go, where's my horse? Let's go, let's go, let's go, horsey. Horsey, let's go. Go, go, go. Wanted dead or alive. Evade the law by escaping from this red search area. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's try getting up here. Yeah, it, it works. Go, go, go. Yeah, let's keep going this way. Okay, we are out of the radius. Let's keep going, boys. Just keep running. They have lost sight of us, so... Let's just keep going. Let's follow this road. Okay. I think we can calm down now. Nice. That was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah. Okay, my share, 187. Nice. How much was the total? Um, F1. Whoops, this is not F1. This is F1. Huh. So, this is Stranger, yes. And there's another job with the J, with John. What does he want? John told you he was trying to get something going in Valentine. Okay. Let's put a marker over there. Sometimes this doesn't work at all. We are very close to the camp. But supposedly we were we are supposed to be very careful about not being followed. So I guess that's a good idea. Is this the stranger? Or what? Guess so. Looks like it. Did the university send you? <laughs> because yeah. if they did, they can get lost. <laughs> I have never been so insulted in all my life. Really? Laughed at. Balderdash. Are you quite certain you're not a spy? <laughs> Those wretches will do anything to destroy me. My theories are correct, and I can prove it. I am the leading amateur paleontologist in the nation, and not one university will hire me because, unlike them, I actually have ideas. <laughs> You're a what? I study dinosaurs. You know, big lizards. Are they real? Of course they're real, you nincompoop. And everywhere. Everywhere? 
This state was once a vast, shallow sea that had the most incredible animal that could walk, swim, and fly. Quite unique. I call it Totalisaurus. Just for now. <laughs> um, I'm trying to gather all the evidence. Miss Deborah McGinnis. Arthur. Good to meet you. Uh, could you give me a hand here, please? Of course. Yeah. <clears throat> Listen. If you find any of these bones around the country, send them to my homestead at Furwood Rise in Cumberland Forest. Or mail me the locations. I'll reward you handsomely for your efforts. Okay. Sure. Sounds good. Why not? And we'll be proving a lot of stuck-up buffoons very, very wrong. Which, so dinosaur bones it is. The very best thing There's a lot of science. stuff to do for these strangers. Nice. Good day to you too. Dinosaur bone, zero of thirty. Okay, which is my horse? These are wild horses. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, damn it, they ran away. Okay, ah, because this chick is going through here with her wa wagon. Okay, so let's go back to camp. Preferably without being followed. Oh wait, there's another one of these flowers. to get six of these for that other guy, I think. I'm not being followed, am I? Doesn't look like it. Let's leave the horsey over here next to his buddies. Camp funds, 111. Okay, people gave some money. It seems. Morning, Arthur. Morning. Morning. Good morning, Arthur. Good morning. Morning. This is the diva or what? The hell? 550, nice. Let's give 50. How you do? Not bad. That's good. Okay. Now we are starting to make some real money. 33, Arthur Cash. Arthur, Arthur, Tilly gave a carrot. <laughs> Arthur, 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 yeah. Charles, 190. Yeah, but not a lot of people contributing. Contributing. Um, tonics and premium liquor. Provisions. Ammunition. Lodgings. Hmm. I don't know, is the camp going to stay here for long? Because if we get um, chicken pants, uh, coops and stuff like that, and the camp is moving, then it's all wasted money.
<clears throat> Let's see, what do we have? We only have John. Okay. I guess we have a bounty in there. Let's go to the to the train station and pay our bounty. Of course, you get over here. Hello? Are you kidding me? Won't follow you if you're in camp. Okay. Get over here. Come on, dude. Hurry up. Oh, he can just walk and camp also. This is annoying. Get here. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go into town. Yeah, we have to ride around a little bit uh, around um, Valentine to see if we find more um, clues to that. Uh, To that um, murder guy. There we go. The serial killer, or I, I suppose it's a serial killer, or at least a psychopath. So we have to see if we can get more clues about that. So maybe we should walk around a little bit in the surrounding areas of Valentine. Because he did that so close to the town that I guess the town will have something to do with it. Some horses here. I don't know how to see if the horses are good or not. Because last time I thought I sold a horse for 30 something dollars and I sold it for 2 dollars. 30 something was what I had in my of my own money. So for 2 dollars it's totally not worth um, catching horses and selling them. But maybe it has something to do with the quality of the horse or something like that. Hope that ain't your blood. What? Your huh. time. Let's get in here. Do we have a bounty? Be with you momentarily. Pay bounty. Liberty is worth every penny. May I help you? 50 bucks. Okay. See you later. Bye. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm going to come back, yes. So, a bridge. The guy seems to like bridges. Let's make like a little... little tour around town and see if we find any more dead people hanging somewhere like it seems he wants them to be found so probably they won't be too well hidden Oops, sorry, horsey. Maybe up here in those rocks.
Hmm, maybe not. Oops, sorry, horsey. There's a lonely cabin. Or a house. So maybe around here somewhere? Let's see what's down there. Oh, there's another big bridge. Maybe he likes bridges. Oh, this is quite a canyon. Um, can we even get there from here? I guess we'll see. This game looks so awesome. Oh, was that where this where that um, crazy snake oil seller was? Oh, can we swim across this? Let's try. Uh, not going very well. Ah, not too bad, I guess. Go, go, go. Swim. Swim, Johnny, swim. Uh, Arthur, not Johnny. <laughs> so, here's a bridge. Let's see. Hmm, doesn't look like there's anything going on here. Maybe we are too far away from Valentine. Okay. So let's get back. Where's this go? Yeah, let's go back to Valentine. See if we can find something over there. Oh wait, here seems to be a fishing spot. Um Yeah. Uh bait. Whoops. No. Oh, we have no bait? Yes, we have. Bread bait, corn bait, cheese bait, bread bait. Let's try bread. Bait, I it's less for catching perch and redfin peccary. Perch are found in the north, while redfin peccary live in the south. Let's try this. Oh, I got you. I got you. Okay, what's this? You're okay. A perch, hey, one pound. Hmm. Swim away, little fella. Yeah. 
Let's see, maybe some corn. Okay, let's see. Okay, another one. Bluegill cord. Ah, bluegill. Nice. Ten ounces. Maybe yeah, I keep this one as the first one, straight. I think. Okay. Let's go do something else. <laughs> um, whoops. Let's go. Uh oh. It's not going too well. Uh, uh, almost there, almost there. Yes, yes, yes. Go in ice. Okay. Let's see if this leads back to town. Okay then. Yeah, there is town over there. So uh, here's a small canyon, maybe. Easy now. Somewhere here. Hmm, doesn't look like it. Okay. Where else could he be hiding a body? Maybe up there, on that dead tree. Looks like, um, I don't know, um, point of interest or something? Doesn't look like there's anything here. Okay. So since we are here, where are those animals that just ran away?
There were like two deer here. Where did they go? Where did they go? They go that far away? Maybe because there's a farm right there. Maybe they ran further away. So that not to be too close to people. Ah, I guess that that could be. Okay, let's get back on my horse. Um, the horses back here you can look out for buying. No, doesn't look like it. Okay, but I guess... Yes, that's it, boy. Okay. I guess that's it for this episode. Um... Next time we will see what we are going to do. Let's go into Valentine and see what John is doing. He was going to look for some opportunities, business opportunities, as far as I understood. And we will see what he came up with. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Come back for more and see you soon. Bye.